Hey, Sean. Yeah, hey, what's up, big man? How much? What are you doing? Nothing. Nothing at all. I brought... Oh, hello, Arthur. And what's she doing? <clears throat> She's doing nothing, too. <laughs> what exactly are you planning? Just a little light robbery, Arthur. Nothing that serious fella like yourself needs to worry about. And you need to get Mary Beth killed as well as yourself? Away with yourself, Arthur Morgan. We'll be getting rich, not killed. Besides, Arthur, I'm so bored, I'd rather be shot. If you insist, I'm in. We don't want you in. We got this ourselves. I've seen you fight, little feller. You can kill any one of us, but I ain't letting you take her out, Robin, not without an extra gun. But she'd be acting, not fighting. Sounds good. Come on, then. Let's go rob this. What we robbing? Uh, A stagecoach some fella told me about. Oh, wonderful. Come on, you can tell me more on the ride. Where are we heading? Back up north. It's coming down from Valentine. I know a great spot to set up an ambush. Just don't start acting like you're the lead on this, like you always do. I wouldn't dream of it. Back to work, boy. Hardy, follow me. Passing you. Like I said, you'll be at the side of the road to flag them down. Give them some sob story. Yes, of course. Easy enough. We'll be hiding up above. Once they're unawares, I'll put in a few shots let them know we mean business. Then move in fast to hold them up. Arthur, <laughs> I guess you can watch and give us marks out of ten. Right now, you're at a one. Jesus. Can't believe you have to tag along in this just to keep an eye on the girl. Remember the crap you gave me for turning up at that train job with Marston and Charles? I'm keeping an eye on you, not her. I know she's solid. All right. Very funny. Hey, she's probably robbed more folk than both of us put together. I wouldn't go quite that far. Let's cut up here. It'll be quicker. Mary Beth can pick a pocket faster than you can blink, believe me. First time we laid eyes on her, she was being chased by three real angry-looking fellers. And we thought, oh, that poor young girl getting picked on like that. But she had a bag full of wallets and gold watches. Happy memories, I'm sure. So will you two write about that in your journals? Can we get back to the matter at hand here? All right. Just over this ridge, there's a spot that should give us a good view of the road. Let's leave the horses here so they're out of sight. We want a rifle with a scope. If you got one, we'll be back a bit from the road. Such a privilege to be instructed by the master himself. This way. See the road down there, Mary Beth? She ain't blind. Come on, you two. This is gonna be fun. All right, Arthur. Me and you will take cover behind that log over there. Okay. You're the boss. Should be coming from the north any minute. You're up, Mary Beth. Well, all right then. You know what you're doing, right? Of course she knows what she's doing. As soon as the shooting starts, get low and get the hell out of there, okay? Of course. Here it comes. I put in a couple of shots to spook them, like, and then we'll move in. Are you sure about that? Your eyes ain't what they used to be, old fella. If you say so. Thank <laughs> you. 
What's the trouble here, miss? Thank God. What are you doing? I seem to have got myself all spun around out here. My horse ran off, and, well, I don't know where I am. You must think I'm such a feather brain. What's your name, sir? Lawrence. Oh, Lawrence. <laughs> Would you gentlemen possibly give me a ride to the nearest town? This is a banking stage, miss. We can't be picking up passengers. Come on, Harry. Nice young girl like that. <laughs> and I'm sure we can make an exception. Be a good <laughs> Shut up. I thought you were just... They seem threatened to me. Give it up. Anyway, we can talk about this later. I'm gonna bust in and grab the money. No, you leave that to me. Fine, fine. I lighten the pockets of our dearly departed friends here. John, you too, Mary Beth. Hold it. We'll split it up later. We better get out of here. I like how you swan into this at the last minute and then make off with all the money. Split up and meet back at camp. Go. We don't have time to hang around. All right. All right. I'll see you boys later. Okay, boy. Let's go. Sometimes I wonder why you stick with us reprobates. Oh, you ain't so bad. Anyway, shouldn't put ideas in. 